What's up good people of YouTube? It's your boy Paper Drew back with another video. As you guys can see, Merino, Advisory, more wood. Let's go. We got another wrap tee from the infamous Merino more wood. Now I will say before we get into this video, like, comment, subscribe down below now because I asked you because you enjoy the content. Appreciate each and every one of you who take the time out to go ahead and view the videos. Uh, go ahead and comment, go ahead and share, like, all that good stuff. With all that being said, let's go ahead and crack into this. Big shout out to Marino Morewood, man. He went ahead and made an option for DHL shipping. I will say on the last video, not the last video, but the last order that I got from him was the Leonardo DiCaprio T. Did not make a video of that particular pickup. Because I plan to do a, well, I'll, I'll let you guys know uh, towards the end of this video. But um, the reason I didn't do that was because I didn't receive any kind of shipping whatsoever when that item shipped, when it arrived, nothing. I just came home and it was pretty much sitting outside. So that's why I didn't do a video on it. I just kind of, it just kind of popped up on me. I had been waiting for so long for it that I just decided to open it up and uh, that was that. So with this one, went ahead and ordered this on the 10th of September ship they actually did start moving and started they started shipping them on the 18th of september and today is the 24th of september and i received it whereas before it was like a month and some change or whenever pretty much uh royal mail decided to drop it off but with dhl a lot quicker big shout out to marino morewood it was only like two or three bucks more to get that done and uh receive it in a timely fashion this shit is fire look at this Look at this t-shirt right here, guys. Oh, my God. Let me see if I can move this down just a tad bit so you guys can get a better look. But look at this. You guys already know who that is. You guys see who it is. The man, the goat himself, Iron Mike Tyson. Look at that. Let's see if uh, we can get some unsaturated look. There we go. As you can see, look at the colors. Everything pops on this t-shirt. My goodness. So this was the Mike Tyson T that he dropped earlier in September, September 10th. Like I said, uh, they were only available for a certain amount of hours. I believe six hours or something along those lines. Sold out, as you guys know, as usual. Got my size, personal size, XL, Marino Morewood. This was kind of a surprise drop just for the fact that um, he didn't sneak peek it or anything he just said that there's another tea coming uh he dropped a couple teaser videos and that was it it happened to be mike tyson but if you guys follow his account on instagram he did have a setra visions tea that was when he did his his uk tour and uh it did have like a like a notepad and it did have like a do Mike Tyson, uh, Mike Tyson rap tea on there. So that was kind of like an Easter egg if you guys were paying attention to things of things to come, I should say. As you can see, it says Tyson, Iron Mike has him in ferocity right there. He's got punching some dude in his head, probably knocked him the fuck out. Um, the infamous, bro, look at this, look at this. The infamous Tommy Hilfiger, big ass polo with the white tiger if you guys saw the chinatown market pickup that i did um i don't remember if uh i didn't pick anything up that had this on it but there was a t-shirt that they did do an illustrated tee that they did do of his white tiger and him but not in in this fashion this is the original pretty much photo um there's him like fighting security and shit like he's about to give somebody the beats like he don't care who it is the black dude's gonna get it Dude over there with the glasses about to get it. The female is going to get it. This dude over here that looks like the guy from uh, from Reno 911 is about to get it. I forget his name. But, uh, yeah, look, look at the colors on this thing. Crazy, crazy, crazy. That's the back. This is the front. It's got that script. It's got that big-ass mic. And then the Tyson and that script, that blue and red. I can tell by some of the tees that I picked up for him. He likes the browns, he likes the reds and, and blues especially. He likes, that's probably his favorite color is red and blue. I haven't asked him. Um, but if I would have, if I was a betting man, I would bet that that probably are his favorite colors, red or blue. Just for the fact of, this is the colors that 
he uses that I've noticed that he uses a lot. Um, probably helps the fact that they pop on black tees. So that probably is another reason why he uses them so much. Um, the browns as well. But they use these a lot on actual, you know, the, the vintage bootleg tees as well. So not really surprised because he seems to do a pretty good job of his research as far as that's concerned. He even got old Mike, like the young Mike right here. See if I can see Mike right there with the, you see he got the part in the head. Got him, same thing right here. It's fire. I was worried when I first ordered it. Um, because I thought that this was going to blend in with the red of the boxing glove, but in person it actually doesn't. It actually does pop, so that's that's cool. I was actually hoping that, or actually was uh, wishing that he had done like blue all the way at the bottom so that this would have stood out more, but actually in person you don't, it doesn't blend in. It actually does pop, so you can see that it, it looks a little bit raised. Um, he's knocking out some other dude there. This is just fire, bro. The, the picture's clear, nothing looks looks ridiculous. Um, you can even see it in the M. You can see the guy that he's hitting, but you don't, you can't tell who it is. But pick any of the one of the people that he was knocking out back in the day, and you know that that'd be him. Um, but yeah, overall, fire, fire, fire. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and because um, he doesn't, he's not dropping anything for probably the next month or so, as far as rap teas are concerned. Um, so being that I got this one in such a good time frame, then I think I'm going to go ahead and just do the uh, rap tea video that I have um, that I was thinking of doing some people have uh, been asking me about it so I'm going to do a rap tea collection video I have another rap tea from back in the day of Mike Tyson that I can compare with this one I could do color um, well just for the front for the other one because the other one is the back one is completely faded but uh, I could do a comparison and kind of show you guys you know as far as if you're getting into rap teas or whatever the case may be then you know what to look out for and things of that nature and kind of how the newer age rap tees um marina morewood is and you know in specific what he pulls as far as the inspiration from those older prints and things of that nature and those older pieces that he incorporates into his newer uh designs that you can kind of see and see for yourself and you know judge if you there's something you want to go with uh but it does say tyson iron mike i just just noticed this just now honestly um because i wanted to get it i didn't want it to sell out and so i just you know mike tyson anything i'm a big mike tyson fan so anything of his i just went ahead and copped it barely i just saw the front i saw the back glanced over it glazed over it um i was happy with my other marino Morewood purchases so i said you know what fuck it i'll just grab it and uh when it gets here it gets here and uh We'll go from there. We'll do a review. But let me know down below what you guys think of it. Don't want it to run too long. Again, I appreciate each and every one of you for taking the time out to go ahead and view the video. Let me know down below what you think of it. Like, comment, subscribe. Not because I asked you, because you enjoy the content. And as always, it's been your boy, Paper Drew. Stay tuned for the next video. will be my Rap Tea collection. And I'll do a little comparison so you guys can see. Let me know down below if you want to see that. Leave a thumbs up if you want to see that. And as always, man, y'all stay blessed. Also, really quick, guys. This just literally just fell out of the packaging cetra visions that's his other clothing brand cetra vision so he does the wrap tees on top of the cetra vision so check it out big shout out to marina warwood so i wanted to show you guys this sticker literally just fell in or sorry fell out of the packaging um as i was putting everything away getting ready to put this up and uh show my wife but it just literally fell out of the packaging so this is the cool little sticker that we that i got with it and dope little design so i just wanted to give you guys a heads up that if you do order you might you know, grab yourself one of these. The first sticker I've actually received from him, so that's dope. All right, so again, appreciate you guys. Stay blessed.